Uh, we're running across Central Texas our wet. If you're out driving this afternoon, this evening, be extremely careful. You're going to find some slick spots here and there on the good side. The moisture is good for our complexions. It's good for our skin, isn't it? Gray skies for us tonight. We got lots, <laughs> yeah, there are lots of moisture coming in off the Gulf of Mexico right now. Dry lines trying to get going out West Texas. It's going to retreat as we see the sun go down tonight. Wind should drop off a little bit uh, in the late night, early morning hours. And I think we'll start seeing a little bit of additional moisture, kind of like what we're seeing right now. Misty, drizzly kind of conditions for a couple of hours to start the day tomorrow. The rest of the day gets cloudy and windy and late in the afternoon. We see some sunshine and then we turn our attention to the dry line again on Thursday and the accompanying cold front right behind that. That's going to come in late Thursday night for you and me here in Central Texas. It's going to fire off a few showers and thunderstorms, possibly severe out in the big country, the Contro Valley. That's the Abilene, the San Angelo area, and northward towards Wichita Falls for that matter as well on Thursday afternoon. Here, the timing of that stuff should probably be late Thursday night into Friday morning. In fact, we've probably seen a better shot at rain on Friday morning. Right now, it is drizzly, misty conditions, 65 degrees at the airport, 100% relative humidity, so we are saturated. So overnight tonight, as the winds continue out of the south, they're not going to see a whole lot of temperature change, but it's gradually getting warmer. We're going to be in the mid 60s first thing in the morning with afternoon high temperatures tomorrow, uh, maxing out into the low 80s. Remember, we were only <laughs> in the upper 20s on Sunday morning, and we're back to spring like, almost summer like weather conditions by tomorrow afternoon. For tonight, overcast skies, windy, damp, 64 the overnight lower. Winds will be out of the south, 15 to 20, and gusting to better than 35 miles an hour. Times overcast tomorrow as well. But we should start seeing some clearing going on in the afternoon. Still hanging on to a very strong west. South winds 15 to 20 and gusty. Once again, high temperature makes it up to 82. Shot at some showers and storms by Friday morning. And then additional rain in the picture for us early next week. All right, that's a spring-like pattern right there. Yeah. It, it is the indeed. Rain, moisture, everything's growing. Thanks, Andy.